Now, how much money do I got on me? Not a lot. Certainly not enough. Okay. Okay, well, I certainly got what I needed, which is some price. Prices. Price thingy. I'm sorry, there's a, there's a little man on my, on my desk. He's really distracting. He's waving flags at me. Did somebody put PCP in my Mountain Dew? What are you? Are you one of those cool docking station thingies? Okay, we're going there. Target now locked on. Start Mixery Gamma. Start Mixery? What's a Start Mixery? A Start Mixery is a boron food factory dedicated to the manufacture of many different boron spices. Inside these factories, raw plankton imported from boron plankton farms is processed and converted into the various boron spices by adding a number of minerals unique to the boron. The boron also add kahunas and soja husk to the plankton in an attempt to make a wider variety of food more suitable for the intersector exportation. Huh. It looks like a little sperm. Actually, I can dock my ship in that sperm, so I guess it's not little. Well, the more you know. I wonder who buys that. Yeah, you know what? Let's go there. Ah, there's the, uh... This is the Boron Stunt Mixery Rolks Shape Gamma. You are talking to the automated interaction system. Make your request. Uh, permission to land? Positive. Please dock as soon as you get green position lights. Woo! This will be my, uh, this isn't my first time docking at one of these stations. Because in my last game, I, I could get in pretty easy. However, these are weird stations. They're, they have the same kind of docking thing, but look at this. This looks like I'm being swallowed up whole by a giant sperm. There we go. If nothing else, I can save my game. Successfully docked. Queen Atreus and the Kingdom of Boron. Bid you a peaceful welcome aboard the Boron Kingdom. Start Mixery. Great Scott. There's a lot of... stuff in here. Those Boron sure do like their glitter. Connection to local trading network established. I think we've already, Start spice. we've already covered that in verbose mode, but not plankton. What is... Boron plankton is found as a scum-like surface that floats on the surface of the chemical swamps on planet Boron. It is produced naturally from certain chemical reactions that are found in the swamp mixing with the ammonia-based air. This scum is collected and then treated with additives and other boron minerals to produce a wide range of different and nutritious spices. Since the boron seas are now completely protected from any industrial usage, plankton is mainly produced on huge plankton space farms everywhere in the boron empire. We need to talk to one of these boron. They look a little fishy to me. Oh! Top. Telexian wheat is grown on the plains of Argon. It is a yellowish green plant that stands four to five feet tall. The top of the plant produces grain, which when threshed, produces a versatile flower-like substance, which forms the substance for all Argon foodstuff. Argon settlers have taken this plant wherever they have colonized a planet, and nowadays even grow it on gigantic farms floating in space. Okay, I'm, I'm starting to pick up on the fact that these borons are very organic-like creatures, whereas the Talati are very industrial. Let's see Soja Husk. Whoa. What? Chinese? Soja Husk is the dried and processed form of the soja bean. 
It is the number one food in the Peronid territory. It can be mixed with many different indigenous things to produce a wide variety of flavors. Soja husk are produced in space factories called soyeries. Oh, screw it. Give me some stat prices. Or... Stat spices bought. Even, even they have ore mines. And they're selling it at a uh, staggeringly low price of 103 credits per. But they do not need stop spice, which is what I have to offer. What's Target this? now locked on. Silicon mine. Alpha. What? You have a silicon mine? How much are you offering for? 295? Oh, I'm charging too much, guys. I guess. I'll set it to 300 once they get back to my own silicon mine. Uh, how do I get rid of these stock spices? Man, and I thought the other trading stations for the Talati made me nervous. This thing just looks wicked. This is the Boron Positive. Please dock as soon as you get green position lights. Ooh. Look at it opening and closing its mouth like an octopus. <laughs> That's certainly creepy. Inspire, doesn't inspire hope here. Oh, I hate those little time jumps. Also, for whatever reason, it's real choppy lately. I don't know if that's something running in the background that's messing with me, or if Fraps is just being all funky. And we go. Successfully docked. Queen Atreus and the Kingdom of Boron bid you a peaceful welcome. It is good to see friends aboard the Boron Kingdom trading station. You know, I think all that glittery stuff is plankton. Oh, this is gonna make me dizzy while I shop Connection here. Connection to local trading network established. Start spices sold. Yeah, I made a decent amount. Not just yet. I already got one of those. I already got one of those. Cargo extension pay ten thousand. That's over nine thousand. Quantum tubes. I'll have to eventually start uh, manufacturing those. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna cut here and head back to my uh, my little home area of Sizewell, and we're gonna see how the mine is doing and how the energy plate the energy plant is doing, because both of those both of those should be doing decent by now. Hey, I just uh, locked onto an argon lifter here. Let's talk to him. Hi. Can I help you? Uh, yeah. Where's Earth? Hello? Where's Earth? No idea. Ask a destroyer. Huh. Okay. That was a short conversation. Hey everyone, it's a Boron Dolphin. Check this thing out. They look like little cigars. Hmm. Let's talk to one. I'd be very happy to be of assistance. Whoa, what the heck are you? Uh, way to system Argon Prime? What the heck? Alright, that was just a tad side of creepy. Or weird. Weird and creepy. There needs to be a name for that. Queered? No. Reapy. That sounds too much like rapey. <sighs> Moving on. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna stop at this ore mine and pick up some ore. Now, first I gotta figure out how to get into it. Okay, it's got an opening over on the other side. Target now locked on ore mine beta. But uh, it's also got close to uh, 100 per unit, so that's good. This is positive. Please dock as soon as you get green position lights. Your mom is positive. Hey. And... Please walk in too.
successfully docked. I don't really care. Just give me ore. Connection to local trading network established. See, all they take is energy cells, and oh my god, they're buying it for, like, ridiculous prices. Hmm. Okay, well, let's... Here's to selling it for more than 118 per. Or bought. And we'll get some salvage insurance, just in case I don't make it. If I don't make it, tell your mother I love her. I've just entered into the system profit share, and, uh... I'm a little freaked out by that planet over there. Seriously, that's like really creeping me out. I don't know why. Maybe it's the rings. I mean, that's cool and everything, and it really does give you a sense of the massiveness of space, because I don't know if... I don't know if you know this, but space is big. Really big. I mean, you might think it's a long way to the chemist, but that's just down the street. And that's just peanuts to space. Wow. Seriously, it's like a giant eyeball staring at me. The all-seeing eye keeps looking at me, staring at me. Why do you judge me, planet? Ooh, this is a bliss place, guys. This is where they grow space weed. Ah, oh, this place should be really outlawed. And if you'll notice, this kind of looks like the pirate base. Good lord. Okay, we need a description on this base pronto. So I'm going to enable verbose mode. All right, computer, tell me about this bliss place. A bliss place is a factory in a secret location hidden deep within Talati sectors, where the Talati produce the narcotic drug known as spaceweed from the stems and the leaves of the Taladian swamp plant. Despite being made illegal throughout the universe, spaceweed is a popular recreational drug used by members of many races and is in great demand. Usually, Due to severe restrictions concerning its transportation, it is only traded by space pirates. In an attempt to make the narcotic more acceptable to various interplanetary authorities, the Taladi are currently experimenting with adding a number of boron spices to the drug to reduce its so-called dependency. <laughs> you know, I'm not worried about it. One day they'll legalize space weed, and this whole thing will just blow over. 